All right, what's up, guys? And of course, always welcome back to our UBL game versus Automatic. And um, his in case I'm butchering this, knee knee Megan nuts leaves. Now, Automatic is the host of this league. Now I've been joined a lot of leagues where here his <laughs> he has been involved. Always a pleasure battling him. Um, phenomenal player and a very tough one to kind of beat. Like he plays a good stamina game. Always worried. Um, a bit more relaxed going into this game and uh, maybe because it's a bit more late at night and I kind of just sell myself but I'm just run down his team is Escavale, Sneasel, Clefairy, Claydool, Lurantis, Mortar, Manetric, Fro, Wishwash and Sudo Widow and with that said we're gonna see what it brings um it's just bad like my Mortar, Fro and um my Mortar, Fro, Escavale makes sense um yeah there they are and then we have Sneasel, which is definitely a good Pokemon, Manetric. Um, I don't believe there was anything here that, that didn't make sense. Uh, all these mods kind of pressures me and do a lot. Um, most worried, I would say, versus... Like, I'm glad uh, that um, Clefairy isn't here, because that makes Ashbringer that much stronger. Um, spamming Outrageous, that's going to be great. <laughs> but... Um, yeah, there are some problems here uh, that I need to figure out. Uh, I think my best lead is either Falsetto uh, to deny him the rocks. If he just starts off with that, or... I kind of assume Rocky Helmet to the Widow with Sturdy. Um, or could lead off Van Height. Um, Miasma is kind of good. Great Nazi Lorantis. Lorantis was also a Pokemon I kind of figured uh, spam in... Um, I'm so glad I didn't see it. Um, <laughs> I'm not able to spam uh, um, Leaf Stormer superpowers and whatnot. I'm glad I kind of avoided that. Uh, I actually think I'm safe bringing Ashbringer first. No? <sighs> it's tough. Any amount to lead off with is going to be like a tough choice. No, Falsetto makes sense. Um, no, it doesn't. Ashbringer makes. Damn it. I. No, shit. Did I get every mon in? Oh no. Oh great, every mon is in at least. What was my lead now? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Maybe less talk, more uh, more decision making. Starts with Watson. Alright. And I, Miasma. So, I don't believe I'll lead off with that. So that this is not ideal um, at all. All right, um, easy as play, Van Height, um, he should go for Overheat or Volt Switch. I don't beat this matchup, by the way, I just can't come in on it. Volt Switch, negate the damage, kind of nice. Um, I want to Toxic him, but I don't want to leave Fro to be an... Oh, we're, we're toxing here. I don't care if Fro comes in. Um, it makes sense to him to carry something like Overheat or Flamethrower, honestly. Um, I assume him to be a Solvist. Flamethrower, and it will do a lot. Oh, no! So, my left door is not negated, but definitely reduced. Alright, so that's definitely not ideal. Do I want him? There is no way he's bolt switching out though, right? Doesn't make any sense. He has no reason just to keep flame throwing. Alright, batting passing. Um showcasing my strat. <laughs> to not be locked in with him. Um Falsetto or Ashbringer? Like I said, I assume him to be um, to be a soul for this matchup. So I just want to chip him all I can and don't get myself burned. So don't overheat, right? Playing for our, right, don't get burned this time. Oof. All right. 
First impression here, should be able to do a good chunk. If Sudowoodo comes in, then so be it. Yeah, like, that's a good switch in. Um, to Excalibur. Yeah, like I said, good switch in. Um, first impression, that's good. Leftover is not a salt vest, that's great. Um, so here comes the knockoff, I'm sure. Which Pokemon do I want to put in position? I'm not against Falsetto. I like it being a Salt Vest, but at the same time, kind of scares on my switch ins <laughs> versus this. By design, of course. And Knockoff does a lot. And uh, from the looks of it, we don't say Clay Duel. So I'm not too scared just earthquaking. So fire punch is the easy play. Um, yeah, like I wanted to earthquake. I think Fro comes in. Um, <laughs> but if this is the alternative, then I take it. Still do a lot though. Not a salt vest either. Leftovers. Question is, do he want to go for a knockoff here himself or just straight out Storm Throw? Because a knockoff play versus Volknosh is going to be annoying. However, that's my best play. Let's see, don't knock off. Damn it. Yeah, you turning on the Sudowoodo, get the Rocky Element chip, of course, but um, it's my best play. Groot. I assume this will be Rocky Element. Yeah. <laughs> so it all makes sense. So, right. Could bring in Miasma and go for either Spikes or a Liquidation. I believe Liquidation scares him out at least. The switch ins are kind of few, so I'll go directly for that. I think I force him out. Yeah. Ernie. Right, how much will we do this time? See liquidation will do. Oh, that's a bulky, bulky bastard for sure. No way, quakes. So we're spiking up here. I think he knocks off or solar throw, and he could quake. And if so, then so be it. And um, knocks off. That's all right. This is a tough game for sure. Um, I'm feeling pressured. Then again, I expect no less from... Um, <laughs> I expect no less. So left doors. Like, what could he do? I think I can Soul Sense versus this. It's a bit of a risk. I think Iron Iron Head does a lot. Let's see. Here comes Groot again. So getting the Swarm Stance is going to be incredible. Unfortunately for me, 
it's going to be um, a huge plane on this. So I gotta get myself some rocket helmet chip. Really hope I kill him. Um, that we did not. That we did not. Really hope. Really hope it doesn't go like it go for a stonage. Ah, uh, damn it. If it goes for rock, then Scyther is gone. Rock Tomb. Alright, we can do that. He didn't have a spinner, did he? No, only boots. He could, however, be cussed up. So I wanna, um, I wanna walk with get this. <laughs> it's a bit of a risk, but I think it's a fine risk. Right, Aqua Jet in, and that will do nothing. Naturally, thing is that consider range his Groot is in, and with no spinner. Um, I don't want to have this switch in and out game, so I just directly go for another spikes. Hope it goes a drill run. Small price to pay at this point. Drill run, easy KO. And uh, yeah, tough play for sure, but uh, I think that was my just naturally strongest one, even though Scyther really want to bring Scyther. Right, bring your falsetto back. Um, I can't over predict too much, which is definitely unfortunate for me. Like, Fire Punch is my best play. But he can't risk that one either. I oh, still gotta do it. I can't. He can play rather safe here, but I really can't. Ernie comes back, nothing to it. Hurts a lot by the spikes. Fire punch, you know, that's fair, but definitely a lot. Not enough, or not as much as I want. I believe this is a matchup I straight up, I shouldn't say loose, but it's going to be problematic. Because I don't want to switch in and out versus this. In the long run. Could I bring Van Height? Huh. Like Vulcan Nosh is my best play, naturally. But I got that mod wheel down so heavily. No, nope, we're doing this. I'm, I am doing some hefty risks here. <laughs> yeah, like of course that's gonna happen. Rest, most likely sleep talk. We've seen knockoff. We already see knockoff. Um, possibly storm throw knockoff. The sleep talk rest knockoff and circle throw, circle throw. All right, maybe this kills. Barely. Let's see if I can cut a corner here. Nope. Right, Tripper Axel, I think that's stronger in close combat if I connect all the hits. I think he's considering that too. This is what I'm saying. Connect one, connect two, and the third will do. Plenty, but not killing. Please, circle throw me. I need to get out. Don't knock off. 
Damn it. Because he'll wake up next turn and rest again. Yep, taking a high risk. Let's see how big this is. Yeah, there we go. I'm just thinking if I were him, if I were him, I rest talk here, hoping, really hoping for a breakthrough. Yeah, here, nice. All right, please tell me Sudo would have dies. Two spikes, please. All right, cool. I think Sneasel comes in. He's thinking about it. At this point, I don't believe I have enough power to break the team. Honestly. Yeah, let's see. But I really hope it doesn't go for nice shot. I get him off guard here. Damn it, like he owns the speedsters, it's so hard to get his rights, but yeah, it's fine. Yeah, I think we straight up lose now. I don't think there is anything I can do from here. As of right now, this is definitely a losing game. I'm going to try a thing here now, which might actually be my disadvantage, but just to not be out, out beaten here. I think I scare him out. Um, yeah, his choice ban and outrage should be able to do something for his switch-ins. If I'm lucky, I will be able to, first and foremost, to it KO this, but also if I only get two turns, I should be able to get out of it. I wonder, it's not a 2-hit kill. It's a lot, but it's not a 2-hit kill. I think my opponent got the best of me. Um, I already said that, but damn it. Oh, it's so close. The chipping is so close. And I get the two turns. It's really, really tough here. Because this straight up means that the earning guy wins. <sighs> I can't beat him. Come on, buddy. No. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Maybe I should have done that. I just... I don't know. I was imagining myself a different team, but he really, really knocked it out of the park. I really can't say much more than that. I think, yeah, I actually think there is, ah, how do you say, maybe there was an ideal situation where I would have been able to come on top, but I am definitely not there. I am definitely not there. I think my opponent plays this game just straight up better. Um, Sure, I, I could argue that my lead was not a, not what I wanted, but at the same time, <laughs> I, that would not have been that decisive. Um, I just, I'm trying to... I'm trying to think how to beat the remaining mods. I mean, Manetric beats... This set, I am so convinced he is... Uh, a Zoltfest. Like anything else, it doesn't make any sense. And as of this point, the remaining mon beats my remaining mons. So I should just try to ship him down and make Toxic do its work. 
Like I said, convinced this is a soul vest for sure. And yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it still do all right though. Like I'm happy with that damage, but yeah, definitely not enough. Putting all my mons in ice, ice shard range. <laughs> but yeah, we're going for a wrap here. Like I said, could have done this differently, possibly. But at the same time, I was pretty much prepping for this type of team. I just looking at it back now, probably should have gone more hazard heavy. Um, not seeing Lurantis for defogging. When I have probably one of the strongest defog in the game, yeah, of course I was kind of thinking something else. But, um, you know, that's my fault. I, oh, we actually managed to go for another round here, so that's kind of cool. Um, <laughs> like I said, like, playing with the idea of what could have been done in contrast to what I'm doing right now, and I feel my opponent just got the better here. Um, you know, I have two Intimidate Mons, so I probably was overthinking my ability to negate his offensive uh, mons basically because that's pretty much it and looking back at this matchup um, we're just bolting here I'm pretty sure he's scarfed please don't be right <laughs> yeah, that was so obvious too Alright, so what I want to do, since I own the endgame to an extent, so I want to fake out uh, and or rapid spin put myself in a more sweeping position and, and then hope that that works. <laughs> but if it's a speedy bank mortar, I don't believe um, my rapid spin shenanigans will outmaneuver him anyway. Um, he does decide to send, which is definitely nice. I take any chip I can get. Oh, that's phenomenal. That's a lot of chip. Body slamming. Um, because I can rapid spin, and I think a Mac Punch is in range of taking him out. Just to get the speed boost. I mean, the speed boost alone is like worth it. Or not really. I mean, he clearly brings Ernie. Is Mac Punch enough? It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> it could try to reserve. Oh, come on, Auto. I thought it was going to give me that. Alright, so Spike. He has one turn off. Uh, how much does Mac Punch do anyway? Ah, it does fair, though. It does really fair. Right, triple axle, rack for black, black. That's my strongest move versus this, really. I don't wanna. Um, like, the alternative of me missing is worse, definitely. Um, he has guarantee one more turn in them to sleep. Please rest. Suckle Pro will do so much to me. Cool. Alright. Um. Yeah, I close combat here. If I get a crit, then I win. Maybe. Ah! Oh, <laughs> oh, it's so rough too. Oh, he's fast asleep still. Oh, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Circle pro, damn it. So I actually think I overpredicted here. Fuck. Yeah, rabbit spin is not gonna be enough. Fuck. Was miscalculating his turns. I should have just mag punched. Not get myself into minus one. Now I shard absolutely kills. Or rap has been the turn before. Oh, whatever. 
I was definitely not thinking I was in a good enough position. He's bringing it down at least the one, the one zero I think because Mike Punch should kill, but um, yeah, Mike Punch wins this very fairly. Um, I don't believe what I could have done to prevent any of this. Um, besides a better lead, maybe keep stacking hazards to get the roll on um, on Ernie, whatever it's called. Uh, because I short here is at me at minus one is sally enough. Had I cheap tri triple axling or just going for mag punch, I might have actually been able to stomach this. I was thinking he was in a better, better position. Um, but I'll happily take this 1-0 loss. Um, it, it's sad in some way, but at the same time, I, I did what I could here. Um, and Auto won this very fairly. Uh, and I had a great time. <laughs> it was a cool game. Um, I was definitely hoping that Saito was going to be like the main Mon. I knew his strat to be able to contradict it. But, I don't know, I just couldn't break it in a way I was hoping that I was going to be able to do. And, I mean, eventually, you know, it took its toll on me. Um, am I sad I lost? Not really. This was a cool game and Auto always brings the good stuff, so I'm happy with that. Um, make sure to check out his side of the battle, it's going to be definitely exciting. And for everyone watching, as always, thank you for doing your so. I hope you enjoyed this game. And I'll see you guys on next week. Until then, take care of one, right? <laughs>